Three straight losses had Brisbane in desperate need of a win, but the early signs weren't good as West Tigers struck first at Suncorp. Marshall on the chase, Tedesco is Try there check also, on side as well. and James yeah, Tedesco wins the race for the Tigers. It proved a brief moment of joy for the visitors, with the host piling on the points before the break. Now he chips about a one metre grubber to himself, and then another one, Reid is there, can you believe it? There was little respite after the break as the host added another three tries to blow away the Tigers. Prince goes through some awful Tigers defence. The Warriors were given little chance of upsetting the high-flying Sydney Roosters, but the men from across the Tasman looked slick from the opening whistle. Harrell goes outside and Nani Lomape claims the Warriors' second try. Their defence was just as tight as Sean Johnson showed amazing speed. Johnson has mowed Michael Jennings down. But the Roosters kept on coming as they turned on the razzle-dazzle. Having given up their lead in a matter of minutes before the break, the Warriors made sure this one didn't get away as they made it four straight wins. Put down the glasses, Glenn Fisiahi will go 80 metres to score. Missing the injured Cooper Cronk, Melbourne looked vulnerable as Jared Mullen had the ball on a string for the Knights. Mullen, Mullen with the chipping kick, is it there? I think it is. Oh, Joey Leilua. He... An upset looked on the cards until another member of the Storm's big three pulled out the big play at the death. Oh, Hoffman to Slater! Oh, Billy! He's under the post! And they will point to the spot. Barlow Park in Cairns provided an unfamiliar setting as South took on Gold Coast, but it was a familiar sight as Greg Inglis got the bunnies going. Inglis scores! The Rabbits open their account in Cairns. Gold Coast refused to go away as the two sides traded tries in an enthralling contest. Ben Teo's effort just before the hour, enough to confirm victory. Luke to Reynolds, now to Teo, there's a try for Souths. A powerful 90-second burst to start the second half from Paul Gallen was capped by a try. Giving it to Gallen! And turned the momentum as Cronulla came from behind to beat Parramatta. While Gallon's New South Wales teammate Blake Ferguson was the star as Canberra beat Penrith for the second time this year. Towards the wing of Travis Robertson who stands his ground and has Blake Ferguson steal the ball from in front of his eyes. Canterbury star Josh Reynolds was in the thick of everything, mainly furious when this was controversially awarded. All the pictures are saying that he put it down short and lost it. Well, oh. they're given a try. <laughs> When Steve Maddai finished a stunning Seagulls fight back to set up Golden Point, that man Reynolds was again the villain, with claims he milked the penalty, which allowed Trent Hodgkinson to nail the match winner. How many is that? Oh. Well, they picked him up and put him away, and they get a penalty, Canterbury. And there it goes. It looks OK. It looks OK. Oh, it's long enough. It's landed in row 13. And in Wollongong, a piece of Jonathan Thurston magic snapped a five-game losing streak as the Cowboys down St George Illawarra. Money ball! Oh! Dugan's taken him out. He might be playing Origin now, but they score anyway. They score anyway through Tate. 